Hello everyone, this is Jennifer Oaks and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a short review of Morimoto Asia, the restaurant, which is located at the landing at Disney Springs. It's owned by the Japanese master chef Masaharu Morimoto, very famous from the Food Network channel as the star of the Iron Chef and Iron Chef America shows. Um, so this is his very first pan-Asian restaurant. And it's pretty much Morimoto's take on Chinese, Japanese, and Korean dishes. You're going to have favorites in this restaurant like sushi and sashimi, some Chinese classics like crispy Peking duck, and they're, they carve it um, in the exhibition kitchen, kitchens that they have. Um, a lot of Korean and Malay specialties, even some dishes inspired by Asian street food stalls. Um, specialty wines and cocktails like the Morimoto Signature Aged Sake and some specialty beers. Um, so the outside is very cool looking, you know, Disney Springs is kind of the place to be in Orlando right now. Um, when you go inside, it's very, it's very nice. I mean, all the servers are dressed, um, like the, the women are dressed like in traditional Asian outfits. It's pretty cool. There's two stories. Um, I really want to try to eat at the upper level next time I go, just because they've got, it's more kid friendly, I feel. I mean, there were kids running around the restaurant at lunch. Oh, and yeah, so they've got 20-foot long chandeliers. Um, you've got some Shanghai-influenced lounges around, some private dining spaces, a second-level sushi bar, and a lounge with a separate entrance. So it's very cool. There was like a little toddler running around upstairs. And they've got like games for kids to play. Upstairs, they've got a balcony. You can hang out with friends outside overlooking the beautiful Disney Springs and all the restaurants. Yeah, there's the exhibition kitchen so you can watch them carve the ducks. Um, and uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. This place only got 3.5 out of 5 stars on Google reviews last time I checked. And I agree with that rating. Um, I really enjoyed this restaurant and I do want to come back. However, the service was really lacking. They took forever to come and order our drinks, took forever to bring the food. It just didn't, uh, the service was nowhere near on par of what I'm used to. Anyway, I'm just, I'm used to a certain level of uh, service at Disney when I come and especially for what you're paying, this place is not cheap to go and eat at. And I just expect a, cer a certain level of service when you're paying a certain price for your food. Thank you. You're welcome. Enjoy. Thank you. So, um, yeah, I ended up ordering the Morimoto lunch set. It was $26, um, and that came with miso soup and a house salad. Very tasty. I loved the food. The food was great. Um, I got a veggie sushi roll with brown rice, which you will see. Oh, and I ordered some um, Morimoto Genmacha Yamashiro green tea. I hope I said that right. But it, it is green tea combined with roasted brown rice. And it was originally drunk by the poor Japanese people back in the day. And the rice was served, as, it, it served as a filler to reduce the price of the tea. So that's why it was known as the people's tea or popcorn tea, because sometimes the rice would pop during the roasting process to resemble popcorn. But yes, very pretty when you're hanging out. Again, you've got those pretty chandeliers hanging out. Um, I, I really enjoyed this at, as a lunch date with my husband. It was really nice. We kind of got away together. So I was loving that tea. That tea was so good. I wish I could buy that in stores. Oh, and then came the food. Finally, 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 we waited forever. But yeah, you'll see it. I ordered the Kung Pao chicken. So you can see I've got the veggie sushi roll with the brown rice, very tasty. My husband ordered the some sort of orange chicken and he also got uh, a brown rice sushi. There were some pickled seasonal vegetables, some chicken dumplings, very tasty dumplings. I loved my meal. You can see how much I ate of it. I, I ate most of it. I didn't care for that bottom thing on the right. I don't know what that was. I can't remember, but I did ended up ordering the mochi mochi for dessert. That just looks pretty. I want to take a picture of it, yeah, a still I'm photo. Sure. And the doily. I split that with my husband. 
You can see the little cup on the side. It had some mango something or other. I don't know what, but <laughs> this was like a fruit, a fruit dessert. I don't really remember. It was almost like a pudding with chopped up fruit and I can't even describe it. You have to, I wish I could remember what was in it, but it was so good. You got to order it. It had, it had those uh, boba tea balls in it, which when you would bite into those boba tea balls, the juice would just burst in your mouth. It was so good. There's the mango going over it. Love this. I will come back to Morimoto Asia for this dessert. I loved it so much. You have to order the mochi mochi. I'm all about that. You can see my reaction. Very tasty. I was surprised by how good it was. And then I saw a flower in the bowl and I decided to eat that flower. So you can see my reaction to eating that flower. I don't know, what, what is that? Is that a violet flower? I don't even know, but it was pretty. And I was tasting it and I'm like, what? What is this, do I like it? If violet was a color, it would taste like that flower. <laughs> You know, so you can see people going inside from the second floor. Again, you've got those beautiful views. I will come back and I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you want to see more videos like this, let me know. I hope I run into you at Disney Springs. I'm always there. So, <laughs> all right, everyone. Have a great week. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.